situation so many of us find ourselves in Western culture where we're trying to fix a thinking problem with more thinking. Right. <laughs> and I'm just, you can't fix a thinking problem with more thinking. And so in the books, what I try to do is I throw so many different non-thinking forms of consciousness at people. And this is what we do in class in the mindfulness class. You explore. And, and I, I always thought of it as a buffet. And here's all these different modes of consciousness that are not based on thinking. And find one that you really enjoy. Because if you're doing yoga, but you're running some mental movie about what you're going to do over the weekend, well, that's that's not yoga. I mean, I don't, it doesn't matter what form you're doing. It doesn't matter what position your body's in. Yoga is the awareness of being in the body at that moment without thought. And then that's where the union comes in because that, that connects you, connects you to, you know, the consciousness. And, uh, and so, um, that's really what I've been doing because once I discovered that you can't fix a thinking problem with more thinking, it instantly like unplugged the whole loop. It just, it, it, it unplugged the whole thing. And I, and I, I think I had, a moment of peace for the first time in years. Hmm. And I thought, well, this is very interesting. This seemed to be a very interesting trick. 